My friends, welcome back to another episode of the Borg Collective. Now, I've been thinking on a way to progress. Now, we have a lot of these colonies, and they have a good amount of population on it. So, what I'm considering doing is perhaps moving a few to our unit complex and try to see if we can build that up. We can always um, increase uh, some of these things. Um, let's see, decisions. Here you go, stage one, change the size by three, so we'll get a few more slots in here. Might be very interesting. Um, we'll see what we'll do. Uh, once population growth really is kicking off, what I do not want is um, like getting buildings that are hardly doing anything. And I believe the unit complex also has looked here the, the maturing chamber. And we definitely want to have this. Uh, the reason for it, of course, is we want to have that additional population growth. As you can see over here, we are getting plus 5.72 from um, from population jobs. And considering over here that is uh, the same, but this one is definitely a lot less. So what I want to do is get at least two more into this unit complex and build this structure up. You know, enough talking, let's just do it. Whatever. Uh, we've got plenty of people around here, so let's resettle you into the second unit complex. There you go. And let's just send in two. There you go. And now we'll have this building open, and we can actually immediately start for the maturing chamber. Yeah, that's the one that I wanted. There you go. Um, at least population growth will speed up. Now, I've been told that I should be very careful with my colonies, that eventually you will get uh, the thing called Colony Harvester. It is in the tech tree. I have not checked. I, I know it has been suggested to me. I'm very sorry for not checking it already, but it's just how I work. I don't like to spoil things for myself because I am as well just looking for um, for changes. What is this? Naval Logistics Center. I have, all, I believe, all of my stations right now. Apart from you guys. Now that is not good. We need you over here as well. So let's do that. So we'll get some more naval capacity. Now before upgrading my stations. I want to make sure that I, if I hit this naval cap. Because otherwise it's just going to cost us money. And that is not really what we want. So the way the fleet is right now would be 129. So, increasing our stations is not going to be the best possible course of action. That's going to be built. That's great. How is this fight going on? Um, so far, so good. Let's speed up things. Uh, we definitely are losing a few ships. But it's almost done. And this is yet another place where they are able... Oh, look at that. The Gron. I do know you from the series. As well as the Anosk. Okay, that is awesome. There was a very tiny settlement over here, and I would really like to claim you. The more, it, it, it's additional unity and research, so that's definitely a good thing. Okay. Mega structure, of course. Military station, sure, sure enough. Oh wow! Wait a minute. Unit like a section. Wait, we can make sections? Really? Uh, diplomacy is irrelevant. Leave me alone. Why? Why? Why so many? Why so many at the moment? Really no. So it's a hopper. Can I do that over here as well? Wait a minute. No, right? Yes, I can. Oh, that is so good. Why didn't I notice that? Well, that's a dumb stun. That That's a dumb question. I never noticed these things. Uh, let's heal you up. Uh, actually, no, we're going to send you here, here, not over there, and by the time it should all be ready, you are heading over this fleet, that is a great choice, I'm very happy for that. We could abandon the colonies. Should we abandon the colonies and just go into the unit complexes? It is possible to, just to get all of our population of these planets into the unit complex. Hmm... I'm not sure if I want to do that right now. What I feel that the Borg lacks is growth speed. 
and the growth speed is definitely more if you have um, a few different positions where they will spawn. But I definitely would like to get that additional section because look at this. It's 7, 30, 17 and this is now 4 already. We want to increase this but population growth speed is now 5.72 which we would like. How long it would take? Well, every year we'll get a pop. As for every two year, we will get a pop from a planet. Uh, diplomacy is irrelevant, leave me alone. No, it's even the same over here. It's because of the... So this is just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven population per year. I think we don't want to change that. I definitely don't. Um, also, there is energy in here, so I would really like to have it. Even though we are hurting our economy. I also increased uh, some of the game sounds because I was thinking it was way too low. I'm not sure how you guys feel about that. Uh, but I felt it was too low. And if I feel something that I... Then I need to change things. You know how it goes. So, these guys now will be completely separating off this part of the galaxy. Uh, we are now going to heal back up, which is able at the Marion Station. And um, I'm thinking about do sending in the armies. I know, I know, you guys are advising against this. Uh, but I'm thinking if we don't do this... Look at that nine. Yeah, we're going to take all of these stations. Look, I don't care that they took some of these um, positions. I don't really care about that. There's nowhere else they can go. And the supremacy will definitely take care of the, the Krinim Imperium. If we don't do it, anyways. A research agreement, which is definitely not something we particularly care about. Let's reinforce the fleet. So there should be a probe being built somewhere. Construction ship is bored. I am aware of that. Can we build these? No, we cannot. Every time that we have some pop-up like that, it says... It's interesting, but it is not interesting. The Borg does not care. We do not care. All we care about is perfection. And research. Yes, research that I have completely neglected from the start of the game. Mm, yeah, we definitely want to increase it. Wait, what? Our primary leader node has died. He has died? He doesn't die. He gets recycled. Ugh. They just don't get it. They just don't get it. <laughs> uh, don't take me the wrong way. I'm just making fun. Um, actually, the, the guys that made this are amazingly good. I really uh, enjoy what they did. So this, this governor will be uh, dying as well. Seven of nine. Wait, five, no, it's five of seven. It's not seven of nine. Go away. So this... We have a uh, the female. There you go. Which apparently does do a, a heck of a job for our income. And I do enjoy that. I do like that. Um, you guys, are you healed up? Uh, you are. You are at 2k again. So I'm thinking... Uh, I'm thinking that this, this one guy is an idiot. This guy is a complete idiot. But we knew that. Yes, that's an amazing choice to go for. Let's go there. Uh, we're slowly taking these guys out. We are already at 90. So the chances for us to really do a lot of damage is, is not going to be a lot. Where's my offensive and my transport fleets? I'm thinking about it is time for you to head over there. Uh, we're going to take all of the systems that are not currently of ours. He will die. He's definitely taking... He's definitely doing a lot of damage there. Um, um, that's really nice. Actually, look at what he did. He took down the station. And he's now fighting that one flea. He will die, but let's retreat. Because that's just, um, dumb. <laughs> it is. It is really dumb. So here we go. We have a 273 one, uh, just getting the, the, uh, his ass away from here. Because he's like, oh, there's no way we can win. A peace offer. Go away. Go away. We don't need you. Go away. We want to have these systems as well, and then we declare peace, because the Borg is no longer interested then. 
Diplomacy is irrelevant. My fleets will go and land on these planets. There's two in here. Um, can we do that in a year time? I might have to split the fleets. How many armies are there? So none. Is this one really worth it? There's 14 population on it. So I'd say yes. Yes, it's worth it. How about you? Armies. Two. So we can definitely split fleets over here. One's over here. And there is two planets in here. Which have three armies. Tell us this. High war exhaustion. There we go. There we go. And there is none over here. So you guys, I want you to merge up. And I'll definitely take these two systems as well. Fleet. Split. And the one with the ruler, you, going over there. This one, the other one, will go over there. And we need to move on this one. So we split again. Could we please select this one? Thank you. Go there. And once the other ones are over here, we will definitely split you in two. Well, maybe not. Maybe that would be a mistake. Uh, but we're definitely going to take a few more planets. What we'll do with them, um, we will decide at a later date. We can always get rid of them. Um, it's just a simple thing of taking all of the population away and um, ridicule them. Yeah, that, that's about it. Go away. How long do we have? We have 600 days. So that is almost two years. Hmm. Okay, you're going over there, and the other one is now over here. Wait, you're still over there, why? Go. If there's no armies, then we could split again. And due to the war exhaust, we don't necessarily have to uh, be that fast, so... Wait, 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 what the heck happened? Seriously, this is what you made up, huh? Okay, but this is still fine. We can definitely take this on a later point of action. You go land. You go here. And land. That's what we'll make those. This, this is, we just split them in two. The entire galaxy, apart from these guys apparently, I definitely miscounted. We need to take out this guy. And we're going to... We're going to be fighting our way south, and the reason for it is I want to fight the Federation, of course. Because that's been epic, and we want that. Also, I don't like this split split thing. I really want to have them all part of my collective. Now you are done. What is your HP? You should be enough to take down this station. I don't understand why we didn't take it. Uh, planetary invasion is uh, occurring. And we are definitely stronger than they are. Well, maybe not. Maybe not that strong. But still, we have three against their two. So we should be fine. Maybe once we get the planetary um, destroyer, um, what we could do is uh, we could just destroy their world. Now, all of the planets that are habitable or uninhabitable for us, and just make fun of the rest of the galaxy because they just have no actual means of getting their population up. Oh damn, you are going to cost me so, so much. I'll get rid of you. Yeah, we'll see what it will do um, for the rest of it. And uh, we're definitely going to look into the other things as well. Let's just do it like this. What will it do? So, we have no unemployment because we just simply don't care. We're going to get that secondary thing up immediately. Um, that's it for this one. Let's go. You are going there. Are you still fighting? Wait a minute. You are over there. What are you doing? Are you not fighting? Armies. Yes, you are. You are almost done. Which is a great thing. 
Man, negative 42, that is definitely harsh. So, give me everything. Critical shortage, we don't care. There you go. You. Head over there, maybe we can still make it. You go there as well. You are heading over there, that's fine. Um, as for you... Armies in orbit of the planet. Like we actually care. Like we care. So, there's five population here. So let's um, replace this one with a maturing chamber. Can we get the maturing chamber? Oh, apparently we can't. Peace offer. We don't care about your peace offer. Why do we not get the maturing chamber? Drone storage. Okay, this is still fine. Oh, oh yeah, there we go. Oh, I was way too fast. So let's replace you with the maturing chamber. Get your population up there. You are heading in. Armies, none. So this should not take too long. All of this is heading over here. We will win. We will. Um, we're going to take a lot of time. Re well, rebuilding our fleet. Yes, sometimes English for me is very, very difficult. <laughs> Head over there as well. Now you're done. Um, did we change you? Yes. You and you. You did, we didn't. So let's get rid of all of this. Wow, it's actually quite nice to see they already have like massive alloy foundries. Replace you with the maturing chamber. So we're already up to 10 population per year in, in a second or two. Um, this, this will slowly go down. It will ruin our economy. So we definitely want to be focusing a lot more on energy. This we can survive. The rest, not so much. Mm. Okay, come on, take this one. Did we take it? Yes. So meaning there was a army over here. No, the other one. You. You have armies. No armies? What the hell is going on? I, I could have sworn there were armies over here. So you head over land. You land. There we go. How long do we have? So we have 200 and somewhat days. I would like to get more of their territory. But first we need to make sure we heal up. Because we don't want to ruin us completely. Um, for the mere sum of a few worthless systems. Rivalry. Yeah, that will work, these guys. No way. That won't work like that. What are you? What are you? Damn, I need to... Oh, wow. You look fancy. I like you. I like how that looks. Um, this colony... Summary, let's see, we've got 5 population, let's replace you in a second, once we get that going, yes, the maturing chamber, where are you? Okay, maybe we need to click this one, then this one, then replace, then go, there you go, secondary maturing chamber, you are building, replace you with a maturing chamber as well, so all of these plants will get maturing chambers. And we are going to use all of these people to fill our unit complex. That's what I made up just a second ago. Mm -hmm. That's how we do it. Um, let's send you over here. Man, this is definitely putting them back. <sighs> no. Okay, there's, there's no need. There's no need to continue. Uh, we do have what we want, right? They will accept for now. There you go. Diplomacy is irrelevant. The Trap Alliance is somewhat weak. Administrative capacity is not interesting, but I do want it. What the hell is this? Chip Senior Crew Upkeep Multiplier. Okay, let's pause here for a second. Um, expand the Unit Complex Stage 2. And Starbase Reinforcements is a Edict. So we're going for the Stage 2 one. Now we have a, a good amount of, um, of planets that will provide us with population. Um, that also means we have a few more sectors, and we want to make sure that that is changed. Oh boy, there's so much to do, and so little time. So we're going to be building up economy, and we need to get nanites as well. 
So build you. So everyone that is being built and replaced is going to be over here. Now we don't have anything. So if we're broke, we are absolutely insanely broke. Will we make it? That is the question. We can also um, change a few things back. We can replace a few population with um, others. So we start getting them ready. Let's take a quick look. If we have some drones not working. We got a backup drone over here. Uh, we're lacking. We're lacking. That's fine. Build. That will immediately improve. Do we have a backup drone? We have a Nanite Harvester, which is a great thing because we are definitely needing those. Frontier Hospital is getting rebuilt. Secondary ground base, that's being done. This one's being changed. Mm. It's getting rather tight. I don't like that. A low stability will die out eventually. And we have way too many star bases. Um, let's get rid of a few, which I deem unworthy. Um, there's our planets over here. There's a planet in here. Do we have stations that do not have planets? Like Omega. Um, did I just destroy? I did. Okay, look at that. The game is wonking out. Yep, I did. I'm an idiot. You, go. Claim. There is also nothing over here. So, let's downgrade. That's 10. We definitely want a few more because this is um, dragging our economy down. Unicomplex and there is a starbase over here. Downgrade you. That makes us 9. There we go. Plus 45. We made it. Yep, we made it. It's all about starbases early on. Um, that's it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed. Hope to see you in the next one. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe or join me on Discord. Have a good one. Bye bye.